This video will show you how to use shift mode and fan speed on MSI notebooks in Dragon Center with just a few clicks. Shift mode helps to adjust the overall performance with preset profiles. Meanwhile, with fan speed control feature, you can set fan speed for different CPU or GPU temperature. With these two functions, you can find the perfect balance which easily matches your requirements. These instructions are only valid for MSI notebooks with Dragon Center. If your notebook originally came with Dragon Gaming Center pre-installed, your settings might be different. In that case, please download the software manual from MSI official website. The model we have today is GT62VR6RD, 15.6-inch gaming laptop with the latest 6th generation Intel processor. Dragon Center supports system status monitoring and includes many features which could only be launched as individual apps in the past. Now you can access all of them at once. You will find lots of MSI's unique features on the System Tuner page. You can set up your own profile and apply it after booting the OS. In System Tuner section, you can find Shift and Fan Speed control features. Turbo Mode provides CPU overclocking settings. GPU clock offset and VRAM clock offset settings when the system is equipped with K-series CPU. After setting up the ratio, press Apply button to apply the setting. Please be noted that when setting the speed to a high level, its value will be highlighted in red. That means that the setting might cause instability to the system. Other modes such as Sport, Comfort, Echo and Power Option can be found on all the models. With Sport Mode, you will have full performance of both CPU and GPU at their factory setting. With Comfort Mode, you will have full performance of CPU, while GPU frequency will be prohibited from ramping up into boost frequencies. The Echo Mode will lower the CPU and GPU frequencies to reduce the power consumption. And with Power Option, you can define your own power plant setting. Power plant feature provides lots of options including the lead setting, CPU power settings, power bottom settings, and even the desktop setting. You can configure everything the way you want and quickly switch between your own setting and MSI preset options using Dragon Center. Fan speed control feature provides four options Auto, Basic, Cooler Boost, and Advanced. In this video, we will use the system monitoring window to show the fan speed. Selecting Auto mode will automatically load MSI preset fan speed. We we'll fine tune the speed to ensure the system stability and to keep the oil temperature in a safe range. Please be noted that when GPU is not used, its fan speed will stay at 0 RPM. Basic mode helps you set the fan speed to a certain level. Please be noted that when GPU is not used, its fan speed will stay at 0 RPM. Cooler Boost mode will boost fans to their maximum velocities. It helps to rapidly cool down both CPU and GPU. If you want to have the full system performance with the lowest overall temperature, Cooler Boost mode is the best option. The last one is Advanced mode. It provides a UI for setting the fans to the best speeds for the notebook and the environment. Here we can set up CPU and GPU fans velocities separately. For example, if you want CPU fans to rotate at the lowest RPM most of the time, just scroll the bars in CPU fan speed to lower RPM and press save. If the surface temperature is too high, you can drag the bars to higher percentages to speed up the fans. This will cool down the node. You should be noted that some models may only include a single fan and for them the GPU fan features will not work. If the temperature gets too high, the fan will start rotating at high RPM to prevent damage in the laptop. Alright, now you should know how to set up shift and fan speed features in Dragon Center. This will help you find your own balance between your notebook performance and its system temperature. 
If you have any further questions, please do not hesitate to contact the MSI customer service team. You can also find lots of useful information on our official website, www.msi.com. We hope you find this tutorial helpful. Thank you for watching and have a nice day.